Now, let's say uh, that here we want the tempo to slow down at B. All we have to do is click on that measure once, and instead of hitting Apple T for entering text, you're going to hit Option Apple T, and there's a it's blinking under the B, but you can see a little tab uh, or a cursor here that's blinking. Right click next to that cursor and these things will pop up here. But I'm just, you can put in the, the descriptor markings, okay? But what I'm going to do right now is put in quarter note, all right? Then I'm going to space bar over, hit an equal sign, space bar over, and hit um, 100 click off of that and then you'll see it'll reformat to get out of there and I can raise the B a little bit before you do the add the tempo so if you want it to maybe sit right there uh, you can get this stuff formatted the way you want it to so it will change the tempo if I'm playing from here And let's say I want to change this a little bit. I'm going to change it from here. And I can just hit a five to turn it into a half note. It'll reformat the measure and I'll put it in an A. So we'll do something like that. Um, You know, so we could do something like that, and it'll repeat, and then it'll go on to this section, and this will do the first and second ending. Um, here, we can go ahead and change the tempo again. Option, Apple, T. You'll see the cursor come up. Right-click next to that cursor first. Then just hit the, the period on your keyboard. So hit the dot, then hit equals, and we're going to say that the dotted quarter... Uh, equals about 70 all right and so put that in and that will uh, affect this so now let me play it from B and I'll play it again Right, and so it plays that, you know, it gets that tempo down. And uh, so however you want to do this, but you can put in different, uh, obviously different tempo markings. And you just have to remember option, Apple, T, T for text. You can do normal staff text by just hitting Apple T, right? And I could write... Um, You know smooth or whatever I mean we can just write some text up here and that text can we can actually attach it to a note put it at the beginning and and that will reformat or we can put it over the tempo uh, but that would just be specific to this particular instrument okay it would just be specific to trombone um, and you know if we want to do uh, uh, text that would be read through the entire score, we would use option Apple T. Or if we want to do tempo change, we also use option Apple T. And I think I put that into the, uh, the shortcuts sheet that I give you guys. So hold on to that and that should help you out. But there's a nice little format for you and uh, doing meter changes, doing tempo changes, and doing repeats and doing first endings and second endings. So hope that helps you guys.